welcome fellow DMV residents and visitors. I am Mark J. Senfilme, a rap div, and DC Circulator bus operator. I started working at the DC Circulator as a professional bus operator in June 2005, when we first started. I have enjoyed driving toward the city, transporting passengers to their destinations. I have met many people of all, all walks of life over the years. In addition, I have acquired a thorough knowledge of the neighborhood, the DC Circulator Services. My current roads take me across town, through DC from Georgetown, to Norma and Union Station. I totally enjoy interacting with the community, being a rap dev employee and ambassador of the DC Circulator, and providing information to tourists and residents. I look forward to many more years driving for the DC Circulator. And with that being said, happy 16th anniversary, DC Circulator. <laughs> now it's my pleasure to introduce the District Department of Transportation, Mr. Everett La. Good morning, everyone. Thank you, Mark. DC Circulator, happy Sweet 16. My name is Everett Lott. I am the Acting Director for the District's Department of Transportation. And it is a huge honor to be with you today to celebrate the Sweet 16 birthday of one of our district's greatest treasures, the DC Circulator. When the DC Circulator began operating in 2005, there were just two routes in Georgetown, the Georgetown to Union Station and the Convention Center to the Southwest Waterfront. Since then, DC Circulator has grown to serve six distinct routes with 139 stops across the district and in Roslyn, Virginia, connecting passengers to many of DC's main attractions and the liveliest corridors. Each year, we provide over 5 million customers efficient and reliable bus service. And something we're also very, very proud of, it's absolutely free. As the district continues to reopen and residents and visitors return to public transit, Mary Muriel Bowser proposed in the fiscal year 2022 budget includes funding to keep the DC circulator free. And in the coming year, Mayor Bowser will invest $6.5 million to maintain the reliability of the DC circulator bus fleet and the bus system and acquire electric changing stations. Six years ago, we began working toward our goal to, to transition the DC circulator fleet to run solely on energy, clean energy, and clean energy power by 2030. Currently, 14 of our 72 circulator buses are state-of-the-art, 100% electric, and we have big plans to add an additional 31 electric vehicles in the next three years. So, you know, birthdays are a time for, for reflection and the past and planning for the future. And under Mayor Bowser's leadership, the future of DC Circulator is rooted in sustainable, affordable, accessible, and convenient bus service. The best gift for riders can give, that the DC Circulator can give in celebrating the 16 years of service is to provide feedback on the ridership experience. We need passengers to take the annual DC Circulator survey and help us continue to deliver great service. You can learn more about the survey here today and then take it online at dccirculator.com. The survey will be open until August the 20th. In addition to the annual survey, we're also seeking feedback on the transit development plan, which guides future growth of the system and the 2020 update. The DDOT, uh, the DDOT used stakeholder feedback to determine the best route to return to service towards seven and proposed improvements to the system operations and performance district-wide. The plan also proposed an extension of the DuPont Circle, uh, Circle Roslyn route to U Street Northwest and we are also accepting public comments on the 2020 update until July 30th. And you can do so online also at dccirculator.com. Again, I want to thank you for joining us on this very special occasion. And now let's get on to the party with celebrating DC Circulator's Sweet 16. Congratulations. Yeah. 